average day. It's varied, it, no two days ever the same. There's always different things going on. You're never bored when you're working in ED. <laughs> it's the not knowing, not knowing what's coming through the door, what you're going to deal with. Every single day, every single minute, every single hour is completely different from the time before. We get a variety of patients, you know, from minor injuries to critically injured trauma patients or patients that have suffered a cardiac arrest, you know, babies, neonates, right through to the elderly. I think it's the variety that attracts me. So we see everything here from um, 0 to 18, so all age of children, with anything from minor injuries and minor illness to um, major trauma and um, very, very unwell children as well. So if we've got a pre-alert coming in, if that's somebody that we've been told by the ambulance uh, crew that they're really unwell, we pull all together so there's a massive team of us that will be ready to greet the patient when they come in. The adrenaline's kicking, the buzzing's going, so we, you just get that natural adrenaline which is amazing. The whole team just buzzes together, we get it done, get the job done, look after the patient and make sure that they get the best outcome for their, their illness or injuries. So there's mixed emotions and I always feel a sense of relief at the end when it has gone well and you've managed to give the best that you can and you know that um, when you've handed over the patient to somebody else, it's um, they are in good hands. And I really get a lot of job satisfaction from making them better um, and being able to help their parents on the worst day of their lives. There's no better feeling than saving a child's life. There's, no, there's nothing better than knowing you went home and you saved a baby today. It makes me want to cry. <laughs> I don't think I could do anything different though. You know, I can't put into words why I do the job. I just I love the job, I love the variety, I love the different cases we get. And it's not for everyone, emergency medicine, but it's also got a, a great appeal really, so it is stressful. We all deal with it differently, uh, but because of that family kind of uh, feeling that we got here, we try and we tend to know each other one way or another, um, and we support each other really. team that we got down there are just amazing. Everybody just looks after each other. We're just one big family. It's fab. When you're working like in the majors, we have that body system where we work together. So I, I'll be assigned here, but I'm looking down the corridor to see my colleague just to see if they're coping. And if I'm able to move down and help them, give them a hand, then yeah, we support each other that way. The type of person that would be good to work in the emergency department is somebody that's really motivated, energetic, adrenaline junkie, I could say that, because it is, you do get buzz, you do get that natural buzz. Um, you'd have to be somebody that can think on your feet. Someone dynamic, someone that likes to help, and someone that perhaps likes to bring solutions to circumstances and, and that we may face. We have a variety of roles for all staff, um, from Bantu healthcare assistants through to Band 8 advanced practitioners and matron. The progression is amazing, if you want it, it's here. We offer bespoke training packages for each grade of staff which are tailored to your needs and we could offer you know, routes into advanced clinical roles, management roles or education roles within the department.